to the line. Little flip on to Brindley. Brindley. Luke Hughes going to the net. They can't get him to pop face center. It. Now another chance. And Bernaskevich had to make his first big stop. He's still down. And Brindley just couldn't lift it over. The outstretched catching glove arm. And we got a penalty coming up here. Our first in the game. Fourth overall pick of the New Jersey Devils. Back in 2021. Back for his sophomore year. Here's Lacombe now. Smooth skater carries in. High shot and he scores. A snipe over the shoulder of Portillo. And Minnesota draws first blood. It's 1-0. All those years later, 15 years later, before a college player was drafted number one overall in the National Hockey League. Here's a chance. Look out. Here comes the ice. Right in. They score. Beautiful setup and a bang, bang play. And Minnesota puts it away. And guess who? Pitlick with his third of the weekend. Yeah, it was a it was a costly uh, mental error by the Wolverines. All right, so the second period's underway. Goal line now in front. Lacombe drifting in there. Goal stick in the net. Gives it back to Lacombe though. Now Brodzinski going to come to this side. He'll go in front of that. That one. Like it might have hit some of the iron there in front. Another chance. What a tip. A great redirection by Jackson Nelson. Sick mitts there to turn the stick blade. And the Gophers lead it 3-0. Reflected off of Luke Hughes. Quick transition. And I mean quick from 21. Look at this kid fly. Backhander didn't get much on it. Wolverines with another chance there. Yeah, great opportunity off a two-on-two that became a one-on-oh down the wing. Yep. Duke in front, and Duke! Can he put it in? And Dylan Duke. They're celebrating. I didn't see the referee pulling behind the net. I didn't either, Fred. The ref was right back there. They're saying no goal. After, after review, we have a good goal for Michigan. Gophers putting some pressure on here with the net empty. The extra attacker. Nice with a drive. Loose puck. And they score. Minnesota gets it done with the extra attacker with 2.06 to go in the second. And they lead this hockey game 4 to 1. Jackson Lacombe opened the scoring back in the opening frame. Nelson looking for the Hattie. And this puck is frozen. And John's still going strong over a thousand That's victories. Amazing. Wow, isn't it? That's crazy. Fred Pletch, Ben Holden, Jim Wrestler, our producer, Matt Litke, our director. You saw the other scores around the Big Ten, Michigan State. If Minnesota gets a point in that series, they would take possession of the Renfrew Mariucci trophy. Yeah. Used and missed by Marks and off the rebound. They score again. Guess who? Dylan Duke, 11.38 to go in the third. It's a two-goal game. Lakeville, Minnesota native slings it up the right side. Johnson plays it back outside of the zone for Minnesota. Now Nyes, what a move by Nyes. Got a man, snug a root in. Oh, and it's kept out of the net. The only thing that went in the net was Nyes. snug a has got it again. Nyes. Now Lacombe. Gets around Hughes. Nelson loaded and fired. And he scored. Getting a piece of it was Portillo, but he had too much on it. And it goes in. And it's the hat trick. Yeah. Horn, soybean, cattle, and now Jackson Nelson. Yep. Under nine to go. Michigan got it down to a two-goal deficit. But they come back and score again. Number 11, Samuskevich with number 11 on the season. And we're back to a two-goal game with 8.53 to go. Those are the types of things he's going to have to do eventually. Here's Hughes back onto the ice. 2.45 to go in regulation. Empty net. Minnesota towards it. And it's in. Ryan Johnson. 6-3 Gophers. The right amount of touch on that one, and Johnson puts it in from inside of his own blue line. Takes the shot on the goal line, Hughes. Trying to play it in front. And Sam Iskavich will come over. Tries one more shot towards the empty net. It went in.